and welcome again to my channel, Born Star Sanctuary. Thank you boys and girls for tuning in for another lesson. Today we are looking at creative writing and we are looking at using comma. Do any of you know what a comma looks like? So in today's objectives, they are as follows. At the end of the lesson, pupils would be able to identify a comma, state the use of a comma, insert commas in sentences. Definition of a comma. We use the comma and in brackets there, boys and girls, you are seeing what a comma actually looks like. And we use the comma to separate words or items in a list. Use of a comma. We do not use the comma before the word and. So if you are writing a sentence, boys and girls, or you are writing a list of items, you would not put the comma before you write the word and. So if it is, is tomatoes comma lettuce comma cucumbers and onion you would not put a comma before and onion okay boys and girls so we're gonna look at some sentences on the next slide and we're gonna see how we use the comma there examples of using comma dogs Cats and fish make good pets. So, boys and girls, when you look at this sentence, you would see that I highlighted the commas in red to show you that we are separating two different items. The items that we are separating here is dogs and cats. Dogs are one animal and cats are another animal. So, to separate those two animals, we put a comma. My favorite colors are blue, red, and pink. Blue, red, pink are all colors. But to separate the color blue from the color red, we put a comma in that space. There are swings, slides, and bars at the park. All three of these are things that we can find when we go to the park. But the swings are different to the slides. And different to the bars so that's why we would have put a comma between swings and slides so you put a comma to separate items so for example put it in the comment section tell me my aunt uncle and the cousins are going to Trinidad can you tell me where it is that I would have put the comma my aunt uncle and the cousins are going to Trinidad. Please leave it in the comment section and I would know if it is that you understood the concept of using commas. So boys and girls, we have come to the end of another creative writing lesson where we would have looked at the full stuff. I would have previously done lessons on question mark and full stuff. So please be sure to check them out Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. And see you again, boys and girls, for another lesson. Bye!